Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Laura, and welcome to my channel. <sighs> Why? Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Laura, and welcome to my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so now. It helps me out a lot, and I really appreciate it. Today I'm going to be doing a get ready with me. I'm just going to be doing this kind of soft, a little bit glam makeup look. I do have a little bit of a blind date tonight, I guess you can say. There's a girlfriend of mine that uh, met this guy through her work or whatever and told him that she needed to meet a friend of hers, which is me. And she gave him her card so he could, you know, think about it, text her later or whatever. Well, after a week he finally decided, okay, yeah, sure. So we're going to meet a date tonight. So, you know, and at this point, I've gone on so many online dates, blind dates, set up by friends uh, that it no longer like phases me anymore. I'm not nervous or anything like that. I'm honestly just excited to go out, have a conversation, eat some good food, hopefully. So, anyways, if you want to see how I got this look, then just continue to watch the video. Alright, so we're going to start off priming. I'm going to go in with my Guerlain Gold Primer. Focus today. There you go. And then I am going to go in with my NARS Radiant Foundation. That's what it's called. It's been a while since I used it. Natural Radiant, Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. And this is in the shade Vienna. So it's the shade well, so let's do that. We're gonna go in with our ah, sorry. We're going with our NARS Radiant Cream Concealer. And this is in the shade light 2.5 cream boule. Went to our Laura Mercier, Mercier, Laura Mercier powder. I haven't used this in a while. Alright, I'm gonna move on to the eyes because we're actually gonna set here. And I like to set throughout my getting ready process just because um, I have such oily skin that I use dry products so it doesn't get over oily but at the same time I don't want to have a cake face so I'm gonna use my Morphe setting spray and just do a once over, do the eyes and then go back to the face. God, I love the smell of that stuff. I really need to order more of these because I'm probably gonna go through that fast. Okay, so for the eyes today, I'm going to go in with the Too Faced Natural Palette. So we got the Natural Matte and the Natural Eyes. The matte obviously just has matte colors, and the Natural Eyes has some shimmers and mattes in there. I'm going to go in with the Morphe Eyeshadow Base. I am going to put it on with the brush because, like I said, I don't want my nails to get messed up. out of the natural palette and it's the lace teddy color. Okay, the next color I'm going to go into is Nudie and that is from the natural matte palette as well. Alright, the next color I'm going to go into is Strapless from the natural matte palette. The color I'm going to go into is going to be Risqué, again, from the Natural Matte Palette. Okay, now I'm going to grab the Natural Eyes Palette, and the first color I'm going to go into is that push-up in the middle there. I'm actually just going to go in with my finger. Okay, grab that dark uh, Risqué color again. 
to the Natural Eyes palette again and grab the Silver Teddy color. I did grab some of my Stila Liquid Eye Glitter, let's read what it's called here, Magnificent Metals Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow, and this one is in Smoldering Satin. Sonia Kashuk one. We're gonna try to do um, liner. I just don't want a lot, just a little bit, just a little something, something. Alright, so I'm gonna let that dry. It's a little bit of fallout on my cheek. Mm. Now I'm gonna move on and do the other eye. And Alright, so, oh, you know what, we forgot to do the under eyes. I'm going to go on to that strapless color again. We're going to go ahead with the rest of the face now. Um, I got my bronzer here, my Marc Jacob bronzer, the Tantastic one. Grabbing a little bit of Cody Airspun here and cutting my cheeks. Alright, I'm going to go into the blush. Um, I've got the Milani Warm Petals Powder Blush. And since I'm going for a bronzy look, I'm going to use a blush. It's kind of like a bronzy color. Temples. It just gives you like that sun-kissed look. And then for my highlight, I'm gonna go in with the Anne Marie Anastasia Beverly Hills highlight. Dreams seen this a million times. espresso and ash brown. I like to use two colors, kind of helps give some dimension. So we are going to do some setting spray. I am going to go into my Urban Decay setting spray. So I have the Slip and the if you watch my other videos, these are like religious to me. I like to use the select down the center of my face. And then I like to use all nighter around the perimeter of my face. Because I'm a face center. Alright, then we got to fan it down. Alright, mascaras we're using today. I'm going to take my Shazado full volume mascara on my top lash and my Clinique Lash Power Mascara on my bottom lash. I also am going to curl my lashes because we are not going to do fake lashes since I don't like them and I don't want to be going like that all day long. that we wrap is actually going to be a lip gloss and it is the Milani Amore Shine Liquid Lip Color in Tenderness. I'm sure I've worn this before. Um, I'm sure if I should have got a different color. I don't want such a dark 
color. Let's take um, this delight one as well. Let's see if we can lighten that up a little bit. Yeah. There, I like that better. Okay, so now that our makeup is done, I'm gonna go ahead and finish my hair and get dressed, and when we come back, we will finish up. All right, everybody, so this is the finished look. Please comment down below and let me know what you think. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so, and don't forget to check out some of my other videos as well. Until next time, I hope you're having a great day, night, weekend, wherever you are, whatever you're doing. Bye, everybody.